<laughs> so Daisy. So yes, we've got to you put it heard together. it. Yeah, well, this we was, had bucks in here. We had bucks in only, and we love bucks. And we, yeah, that's bucks used to be in your role. You know that bucks was did he that. He was you, oh, no. yeah, or, or you were him. Or in some capacity, he, he was, was in our, this role. Our mm. regular correspondent mm. for a couple of years, and mm. and uh, we, whereas he'd left his fig jam days behind him, then whereas you're in the thick of yours <laughs> now, yeah, <laughs> yeah right thought. in the midst. <laughs> but here is bucks. We put it to him. He'll be a one team player. I'm sure of it. That you're not sure of that. That's absolutely. Right. How are you sure of that? Because I know Daisy. What do you say to that? I would... See, this was... I went on to a show the other week and made comments and they got blown well out of proportion. I would love to be a one-club player um, and hopefully that happens. What club will that be? <laughs> well, if a one-club player would mean I'd stay <laughs> in Collingwood. We just need to make it clear. No, I think... Look, I think Collingwood supporters will be happy to even just hear that, Daisy, honestly. So you're, you're not drawn anywhere else? You're not, for instance, drawn... To follow Mick Malthouse? No, not in any capacity at all. Even with 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 Greg Swan there, your great friend Swanee. <laughs> <laughs> you guys in this angle. No, look, I, I'm hopeful that I will stay at Collingwood. I hope that I can prove the coach right. So the pull of Dane Swan is stronger than the pull of Greg Swan. Correct. What right, if Swanee in the comes? Of the if Swanee comes to Carlton, you'll come, won't you? It's two Swans at Carlton. No, you yes. Dane's not allowed to go anywhere. Doesn't he? No. Oh, isn't he? Unless Swanee's a nightclub, but <laughs> sure. <laughs> wow! Well, but when you you say I'd love to, it comes down to well, he's he's, he's he's doing some bloody he's doing renovations on his house. That's not cheap, is it? That's his brother-in-law not, doesn't no, he charge top dollar. Of his Football isn't all about money, but at the end of the day, it's a job. So you have to try and do what's. What is it at in, the start of the day? At the start of the day, when you first get in there, mm-hmm. I think it's a there's a, probably a lot more love for the game. And what yes, you're doing. right. And then as you go on, it becomes... Uh, you wisen up a little. You do wisen up a little. You, look, I still love football and still love what I do, but the industry and the way it is now, with free agency and alike, it becomes more of a job and you have to look out for your own future. Well, when you see the, how the AFL deals, it's no doubt that you're a commodity that and you're correct. a valuable commodity. When do you become a free agent? Is that soon? That's after 10 years. So I'm a restricted free agent at the end of this year. Yeah, and right. after how many years is that? That's after eight. And so what's the restriction? So we have to give. We have to give to get. Carlton would have to give someone. Is that right? No, no. So it's the. I think the way it works is that if an offer's put to myself, the club can match it, and if the club matches it, then I stay. Oh, regardless, right. so Swanee could just look after you. Swanee could say, "Oh, oh yeah, we'll yeah. give a million bucks." Yeah, <laughs> a day. <laughs> no.